Small business owners and entrepreneurs, is your writing killing your chances to get new customers? Now there's an easy way to write better. Blogs, brochures, emails, and totally online. The Write Like a Madman online resource library. Check out writelikeamadman.com. Sign up for the free newsletter and get ready to start making money like crazy. Click the link below to find out more. Hey everybody, how's it going? Today I'm going to show you how to disable spying in Windows 10. Normally, when it comes to disable spying, you would do it in the Windows setup under customized settings as opposed to using the express settings, but this is not the case. This is going to show you how to do it while in the operating system itself. So, without further ado, let's get right to it. Okay, so when disabling the spying on Windows 10 in the operating system, it is very easy to do. All you have to do is go into Start, and then click Settings, and then you go into Privacy. Much like the setup screen, you'll notice that these privacy features are set to On. We will want to turn these off. Now, this is just the general section. You'll also notice on the left that there is Speech inking and typing personalization, diagnostics and feedback, and activity history. All of this under Windows permissions is what you definitely, definitely want to disable. So this is just the general section. Time to go into the speech section. We will want to turn this off, then into inking and typing personalization. Set that to off diagnostics and feedback. Now this is where it gets a little tricky. With diagnostic data you'll see there is a full option and a basic option. The full option sends all of the basic diagnostic data in addition to websites you browse and how you use apps and features and the device health, device activity, and uh, advanced error reporting. But we don't want that we will want to set that to basic instead. Now, to turn this stuff off, we will want to turn off the improve inking and typing, the tailored experience, and uh, turn off the view diagnostic data. If you should, you can totally delete the diagnostic data that Microsoft has collected about this computer, but there, there is no data that I need to delete. But if you want to, you can click that. And then now we will want to go to activity history. This does not use on or off switches. It uses checkboxes. You can jump back into what you were doing on your device by storing your activity history but we don't want to so we will want to turn that off and you can do the same thing even if you switch devices by sending Microsoft your activity history but we don't so we will want to uncheck that as well and now we can close out of this and it's that simple so that is how you disable spying in Windows 10 while in the operating system itself. Thank you for watching. Please make sure to subscribe, hit that like button, and check out some of my other tech videos too.